Hey everyone, in this episode, we are going to talk about medications can be causing vitamin B12 deficiency. These medications are known to decrease vitamin B12 levels. Stay with us to learn more about this topic. The first medication that I will start with is colchicine. Colchicine is generally used for treating gout attacks and it can also be used for familial Mediterranean fever or, or other diseases, but we are generally using it for gout attacks and it can be causing vitamin B12 deficiency. Chloramphenicol, we are using it for treating eye infections and it's also decreasing vitamin B12 levels. Ethanol alcohol can be causing vitamin B12 deficiency. Histamine 2 receptor antagonists, which are used for reducing the amount of acid produced by the cells in the lining of the stomach. Metformin, which is used for um, lowering blood sugar levels in type 2 diabetes. And proton pump inhibitors, which are used for relieving symptoms of acid reflux, gastroesophageal reflux disease. And in vitamin B12 deficiency, you are going to see some signs and those signs are anemia. For example, you can see fatigue and pallor, neurological disturbances, and those are generally symmetrical. Peripheral neuropathy, you can see tingling, numbness, pins and needles, sensation, coldness, and generally these are seen in lower extremities such as legs neuropsychiatric disease and you can see reversible dementia and when you give them vitamin b12 that is completely reversible autonomic dysfunction is another sign you can see impotence and incontinence and in order to diagnose vitamin b12 deficiency you can use shilling tests and in severe deficiency, we are generally using intramuscular supplementation of vitamin E12. For example, cyanocobalamin or hydroxocobalamin. And that's the end of the video. If you find it helpful, please consider liking, commenting and sharing with your friends. Take care.